Welcome back to Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome. I'm Burning Dog Face. And at the end of the last episode, I earned the achievements Give Caesar What It's His for purchasing and using an upgrade in combat, and I Have a Story to Tell for completing the beginning on any difficulty. Now, we're going to spend some time with Marius' family. Ready yourself. First, break my guard. Open guard, press Y. Some enemies require that you open their guard. Oh, jeez. Oh, they're wooden swords, okay. Once more. Go. Oh, I didn't count. That's it. Good work, my son. Now do it again, but this time strike me three times. Oh, okay. Blocked you. Start again. One more time. Oh. Excellent sword play. Okay. Ready yourself. I noticed in that last cutscene. A brief window to make the move. I noticed in that last cutscene. I'm trying to say when he had his helmet off that Marius has kind of a Clive Owen thing going on. I approve. Oh, my face. Perfect. You really have to stay on top of the deflections. Now put your moves together. Combined attack. For the right moment and strike again. I suck. If I just became a soldier in this flashback, shouldn't he not have like the the broom thing on top of his helmet? Shouldn't he just have generic ass armor? Or is every Come Roman on. soldier this fancy? Break my guard. Oh right. That's the way. Masterful. Cool. It's a sad, but proud day. The day a son first beats his father. He may have mastered the sword, but never rushed to meet the world with it drawn. Always come open-handed first. Walk with me, son. I've heard rumors there is great unrest in Rome. Yes, these are dangerous times we live in. This election could change everything. I'm giving this to you as your grandfather once gave it to me. When your time comes to command men of your own, think back on what I'm about to tell you. Legend says that Damocles was a great warrior. A revered leader in a vast army. During a massive battle, his cowardly commanders abandoned him. What's it hitching up? Stop that. When the slain Damocles arrived in the underworld, 
Nemesis, the goddess of revenge, was enraged at how the brave hero had been treated. She allowed Damocles to return to the world as a vengeful spirit, a ghostly, black-armored centurion, who would hunt down and kill each of the generals who had wronged him. To this day, many commanders carry a dagger with the image of Damocles on the scabbard. This dagger reminds them to always look after their men or risk the Black Centurion returning from the dead to avenge their selfish mistakes. Come on, bring it. Do you mind, buddy? I'm trying to murder your friend here. Fuck. Bring it. Nobody's hurting my sister, not on my watch. No. in the achievements find your mother and sister forever lost achievement unlocked oh those are just updates for yeah like this is one of them head executioner perform 100 executions in any game mode at this rate I can kind of see it going that way because I'm killing every bad guy that way oh get me while I was unpausing let me finish up with you so I can join the party. What's going on? I should think it should be fairly obvious in areas. Sleep it off. I keep hitting X to start things off, even though it almost always starts with Y. Not this time. Wow, I just steamrolled that guy. I am entirely on board with this plan. Do you mind, buddy? I'm trying to kill your friend. That's a damage bonus. Nothing to sneeze at. Father! 
Listen, they mean to kill us, Marius. We must get to the Senate House to save my people. Just you and me. Come on, Marius. Barbarian Graham Green here knows my name, and that kind of raises my eyebrows. Embrace your death. Your acting was overrated anyway. No, it's rude to the real Graham Green. I apologize. <laughs> That's meant to be. When it does one of those little hitches, the frame rate doesn't change. I don't know what's happening. Monarch butterflies. Hard to believe all this terrible all these terrible things are happening in such a beautiful place. Didn't even get to meet his sister. So other than a general love of murdering people, what do the barbarians have against Rome anyway? Aren't there less, you know, ridiculously well-armed targets they could have gone for? Sundial. He does that when I hit the uh, execution button. Now you can swing those at any time, but there's what happens when you deflect, and there's execution. Pardon me for a moment, I just realized I never started my timer. No harm done. I guess I have to deflect this dead body's attack. Achievement unlocked, and it doesn't update these automatically. Letters from the front. Collect one scroll. Uh, oh. Cool. Piss! I missed one in the beginning level. Oh, it's from Dad. SPQR. That's the name of the level, I guess. Leonidas. How long ago it seems that my days were spent in the military. How tiring it was marching through treacherous forests, surviving raging seas and dangerous lands, or the risk of death is more eminent by terrain than barbarians. Although it is difficult to forget the rush of chasing down an enemy, will they escape? Will they turn on me and fight? Then as the last breath escapes their mouths, carrying on to the next fight, then again until exhaustion sets in? Those days are long over for me. I know this military life is one Marius will greet with pride, loyalty, and the brutal spe strength and speed of Rome's finest. Ah, uh, look at it! I missed nine things in the first level? How the fuck did I do that? Piss drink! Well, you can replay the levels, I think. Oh, 
Oh yeah, something I wanted to mention. This game was developed by, of all people, Crytek. The people who, uh... More famously made Crisis and the original Far Cry. <laughs> I, Nero is a eunuch, it says. Missing, uh... Do you like the idea that... Father! Oh, hey, Dad. But, uh, yeah, I mentioned this because... Uh, you can customize your... You have a guy in multiplayer that you, you know, you can have in these, uh... Co com competitive levels in the arena, or you can have co-op levels with your friends. And you can unlock equipment for your guy. Which is cool. But, uh, down here you can have... You can either appear with this first uh, option... With the skin, you can either appear in a gen as a generic guy wearing the uh, the equipment you have equipped, or they have all these other skins that don't change your stats, but uh, make you look you know cooler. So there's a bunch of character. And I'm assuming these are characters, and uh, you know generic soldiers from throughout the campaign. And then there's this. <laughs> Nano Suit 2.0. Surprise the hell out of your opponents by bursting into the Roman gladiator arena, decked out as a post-human warrior. The Nano Suit is best known for tearing the limbs of, of alien invaders, but its design mantra of adapt, engage, survive should mean it has zero problems slaughtering barbarians and praetorian soldiers from ancient history. Maximus Virtus. And I, uh... Ran that through a translator, and that's Latin for maximum courage. So that's really funny. I'm assuming this is here because I also have Crisis 2 on my Steam account. I actually wanted to do a Let's Play of that years ago, but, uh. Crisis 2 has an issue that is, uh, specifically associated with fraps, where. Uh, the longer you record with fraps in that particular game, the more the visuals and the audio in the recording go out of sync. So I thought I would never be able to record it, but now that I've got this uh, new program, you know, who knows. Hopefully I'll be able to come back and do that. Got you! Now I'm just being a vandal. The, uh... Interesting thing is, I tried playing, uh... Crisis 2 on my own time. You know, once I realized I couldn't do a Let's Play of it with Fraps. But I only got a few hours into it, because... Something about the way it ran made it so that it would run for about an hour or so, and then it would overheat my computer, and it would, and which would hard reset itself in order to save itself from being damaged. Marius, this way. Hey, Dad. Mori Nero. Okay, well, there's Nero being drawn as a woman, but oh fuck. Roman tourist. Oh, she's not fucked. Fuck. My god, this man is a juggalo. Nero. He appears to be drawn as a uh, satyr, which are known for partying and having sex to the exclusion of all else. No, 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 
no, no, no, no. I don't have time for your bullshit, buddy. Quiet, you. What's that about? She even unlocked time to fly. Perform your first environmental execution. Uh, Roman tourist, collect your first vista. Well. There's, uh, the timer. So I guess I'll just call it right here. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome. When we, uh, continue kicking ass and taking names, I guess. Later!